Hello, hello. Welcome to my channel, Perry James Gaming. Before we get started, I'd like to say that this is my first time recording my voice, so if there's a mistake, so I'd like to apologize in advance. With that being said, let's get to the video. Alright. As you know, there's a new banner. Five star is Yoimiya and four star is Sayu. And today's video is gonna be about Sayu. I'm gonna be talking about her kids, her skill, her birth, her talents, her constellations, and her artifacts. Alright, let's go. Sayu, a new 4 star Claymore user with a vision animal. Alright. Her normal attack, nothing much, just a 4 attack sequence. 1, 2, 3, 4. Very nice. Alright, then let's move on to her elemental skill. Her E can be either press or hold. Let's see, her E is going to be a quick kick with 6 second cooldown which is really short, really nice. And when you hold her E, she's going to be a rolling ball moving really quick without using stamina. She's going to be really really nice exploring the world. Her E is similar to Child E, meaning the longer she rolls, the longer cooldown, and the maximum roll, I mean the maximum cooldown, is 10 seconds. Okay? The downside of her rolling is that it's similar to Ayaka's dash and Mona's dash. When you are going up the stairs, you're stuck. Hey, go. Yeah, that's her downside. The damage is okay, I guess. All right, and let's move on to her burst. Her burst is like Jean's burst. It deals damage and it also heals the character. The energy cost is pretty high, 80. And there's a threshold of the 70% HP, meaning if the character has more HP, uh, the, the raccoon will attack the enemy instead. But if the character has less than HP, it will heal the character. However, uh, if there are no enemy nearby and the character current HP is more than 70, it will continue healing the character, which is nice, unlike Bennett. If the character has more than 70%, it will never heal unless the character got hit and HP is lower than 70. The burst healing scales with her attack, just like Chishi. Haha. <laughs> and her passive. Her ascension passives, the two the two passives, pretty much what they do is help Sayu heals better. And the last the um the passive everyone is excited about is this passive how do you read this you who are silencer secret basically what it does is that when you go near the crystal flies they will not fly away from you anymore not just crystal flies there are other animals too let me show you what the animals are 
Let's go here. There are categories birds, beasts, fish, and other. So, Sayu's talent only worked in this category. Crystal flies, salamanders, that's what I call them, frogs, and crabs. Really nice. Uh, I've already tried this. Crystal flies, if they are in a group, none of them will fly away when you get close to them. Technically, you can pretty much touch them or push them, you know. Uh, when, but when you collect one crystal fly, the others will start flying away. So keep that in mind. The salamanders, they will start running away also. If you catch one, the rest will start dashing away. But the frogs and the crabs, they don't. Let's say there's three frogs. You collect one, the other two will not run away, which is weird. I don't know why they're not the same. The frogs, the crabs, they're the same. Uh, these lizards, I'm not sure. I have. <laughs> I don't know the location where they they are in a group. So, but you know, it is what it is. All right. So let's move on to the constellation. Her first constellation removed the burst. 70% HP threshold so meaning the the raccoon the tanuki will start no no will how do you say it will attack the enemy and heal you at the same time which is nice I like it I don't like I don't like having the restriction you know that's why I pulled the first constellation all right, the Sayu's second constellation. Technically, what it is is that the longer you roll, the stronger the kick. It. That's pretty much it. So, if you like Sayu to do damage, I would recommend her C2. Her C3 increases the level of Sayu's burst. C4, she recovers energy better. C5, increase the level of her E, her dash. And her C6 is that her burst will now benefit from her elemental mastery, meaning it will, do, it will deal more damage and it also will heal more. Which is kind of good because so I use uh, Ascension, get Elemental Mastery. Let's move on to the Artifacts. Because she's an animal, of course her Artifact would be VV set. It's the best set for animal. So, my Sayu build is a healing support. I have test it between VV set and the maiden set so far my final thought for the artifacts is that for winner sets I mean four pieces of winner and then the circle is the healing bonus. So, overall, my thoughts on Sayu. I really, really, really like her. I'm glad that I pulled for her. First of all, because of her talent. This one, for collecting the crystal flies. Second, her. E, I can move around 
pretty quickly when mining that helps a lot on top of that she's an animal meaning i can do the animal resonance lastly she's a claymore she can dis uh, destroy the crystals when they mine which is really nice those are the reasons i pulled for her and of course i like c1 because i hate having this restriction that's why so there it is my sayu a healing support and that will be all for this video my first video with my voice i hope i did all right if you've watched this far thank you um please like and subscribe i will do more videos in the future all right see you next time thank you